Hey! <laughs> Grandma! Okay, guys. In the first round, I want you to prepare a Coca-Cola jelly for me. That's easy. Gotcha! Jelly? Oh, I've never done this. And I really even have an idea where to start. First, of course, you need to take a Coke. Let's do this. Uh, almost perfect. Except for a couple of drops. Oh, chill, you better try off. Oh. Oh, thanks, Grandma. First of all, I need to free up the Coke bottle a little. I'll do it in the most pleasant way. And now, the signature burn. Uh. Oh, oh, wow! And you were saying something about manners! Okay. You need to add a little candy to the cola. It'll be tastier and more beautiful with it. Next, I'll pour corn syrup into the same bottle. And it's thanks to it that my cola will soon turn into jelly. It remains only to shake it thoroughly. Oh, <laughs> it seems the corn syrup was too sticky. Yeah, let's move on. Wait. Yeah. It's definitely too sticky. We'll have to tear it out by force! Otherwise, how will Becky taste my masterpiece? Oh, come on! Oh. oh. It worked. Oh, well. My jelly is almost ready. It remains only to cool it a little so that it is even more jelly-like. And delicious to taste. Awesome. Oh, everything is too complicated. The best jelly is ordinary honey, which you can just put in ice. Isn't that a brilliant idea? Yeah, complete nonsense. I'll show you how to make real jelly. To begin with, pour the cola into the pan. After that, I'll throw some cold marmalades into this cola. They will melt and make my future masterpiece even better. The last ingredient is secret. I'll give the jelly a brilliant glow. Now, the resulting mixture should be cooked in a frying pan, stirring it thoroughly. And when the jelly's ready, you can pour it into a bottle. Just like so. Filling it up. And the last step is pulling the jelly. Okay. No one can handle this as well as liquid nitrogen. We need to fill the bottle. Then wait a few seconds. Children, be careful. Do not do this without adults. Ready. Vicky, it's time to choose today's winner. I don't even know where to start. Everything looks very appetizing. Perhaps let the grandmother be the first. Um, tastes like ordinary honey. Now it's chef's turn. It looks beautiful, of course, but why is it so shiny? Well, Jill is the one left. Wow! Very tasty! I think no one has a question. Jill becomes the winner! Yeah! I knew that! <laughs> oh, what is this? This is everything you need to make waffles. Let's go, guys! It'll be done. Uh, waffles? But what? Oh, waffles are my signature dish! And I know better than anyone what kind of waffles my granddaughter prefers. First, you need to knead the dough. Everything is standard here. Flour, eggs, butter. And oh, we're without sugar and milk. Milk, by the way, is unrealistically good. The dough is almost ready. How do you like this speech, huh? Um, not impressive. My machine does it faster. Oh, oh how so? Oh, 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 faster! Oh, faster! Oh, chill, I'm sorry. Yeah, with two hands, it's way faster. Yeah, I doubt that. Here, I have everything ready. It remains only to divide the dough into small parts. And now, putting them in separate bowls. It's colorful. Now we can cook our waffles. With the help of colored dough, I'll be able to make colored waffles. And I also have it very tasty. I've already tried everything myself. 
Yum! Hello. Do you think you can compete with the great chef Annie? As if not so. My rainbow waffle is ready. Now you need to present it beautifully. Why not do it on a black plate? And some whipped cream will play the role of clouds. And a little bit of color sprinkles will not hurt. For extra beauty. Awesome. Right on top. Oh, I know that my granddaughter loves my grandmother's waffles the most. And they're already done. Decorating them with ice cream and berries. There is nothing better on such a sunny summer day. And a little maple syrup wouldn't hurt either. Yup. That's weird. <laughs> Calm down. I have everything under control. Oh, man. Or not. Oh, I have an idea. I'll definitely have something useful there, but not that. Oh, big ears! I didn't know you had time to get into my backpack. Oh, and here's what I need. Noodles. It is from the instant noodles that I'll make a new waffle. Putting it in. Look. It turned out very appetizing. Oh, um, I don't think so. And let's ask Vicky. Well, well. What kind of noodle waffle is this? Never seen this before. I hope this is also good. Let's check it out. Ugh, disgusting! I've never tried anything worse in my life! But grandma made waffles like I love. It's nice to know how some people care about you. Thanks, grandma. It's unrealistically delicious. Oh, yeah. Cool. Wow. And Chef Annie made a real work of art. Besides, it's very tasty. Bravo. But perhaps this time no one can compare with Granny's waffles. I love them since I was a child. She is the winner. Oh, hooray! I knew I could beat everyone! What is it this time? I want donuts. I hope you'll please me with them. I'll make donuts quickly. Hey, delicious. Oh. Oh, never mind. Delicious? I agree. Natalie's <laughs> so good. Uh, uh, have we already started? Uh, sorry. I was completely distracted. But okay, I'm ready to start cooking. First, I need to take a pack of Oreos and crush the cookies. Ta-da! Now this crumb needs to be mixed with Nutella. My favorite part of cooking. Because after that, you can try what I've got. Oh yeah, yummy! It remains only to pour the resulting chocolate mixture into this machine for making donuts. Just look at that! Oh, where is it? Oh, here's the donut mix. Thank you, chef. I'll pour it in the form of the mold. And let's wait. Ah, uh, how slow you are. Here are my mini donuts already. Look how lovely it is. Now they need to be divided in half. Just like so. Gotcha. And then I'll put some syrup inside. Almost done. Now I need liquid marshmallow. Which I'll decorate my donuts with right on top. To do this, I'll put it in a bag and squeeze it on the donuts through the hole on the other side. So convenient and very tasty. And the last step remains. Sprinkles. Without it, donuts are not donuts. Just look at how quickly I cooked it. Masterpiece. You can only envy. Oh, why so? My donuts are almost ready. I just have to sprinkle them with powdered sugar. Oh, oh, chill. Oh, I'm sorry. Now everything is ready. I want to try these donuts, but I'm holding on. Oh, they're for Vicky. <laughs> and for her sister, Jill. Oh, what a mess. 
No need to wave a dangerous device like that. Yeah! Look how lovely it is. <laughs> and these donuts will be even tastier after I additionally smear them with Nutella. Vicky, it's time to choose who wins this time. Chef Annie has the most beautiful donuts. I want to try them first. Mm, they're not just beautiful, but also incredibly delicious. I'm absolutely delighted. Next, let's try grandma's donuts. Oh, delicious! But, too usual. I was waiting for something more. Jill, I hope your donuts will surprise me. Chocolate like I love. But, Chef Amy still has the most delicious donuts. Let's congratulate her on her victory! Oh, thank you very much. oh, someone has appreciated my abilities. What does my grandson want? French fries! Great, I'll cook the most delicious potatoes. First, you need to pour the oil into the pan. And now cut the potatoes and fry them properly. Grandma, it doesn't really look like french fries. <laughs> For the best. Then I'll win this round. So, I'm going to peel the potatoes. Oh, um, it didn't work out very well. We need a special peeler. Yes! Now it's going to work. Hmm. Yeah, that's how you need to cut potatoes. One, two, and you're done. And no one makes fries in a frying pan. After all, this is a deep fryer. We put potatoes and fry it in oil. There we go. Just look at this golden crust. Great. Oh, where are my potatoes? Did I peel it all off? What do I do? Don't worry, dear. But what potatoes are without sauce? Ketchup is not for me. I'm the chef. And all the best chefs in the world cook tomato paste on their own. Well, here's a masterpiece. Perfect french fries. Everyone has already fried the potatoes and I have these skins. What do I do? I know. Why suffer if you can just order delivery? And here are the potatoes. Oh. Mm, homemade potatoes. French fries from the chef. Wow, so many delicious things. Except for this one. Mm, and these potatoes look delicious. I'll try it. Oh, how spicy! I don't want spicy. What do we have here? Mmm, delicious. I like this French fries. Hooray, I won! That's it. So, so, what are we cooking now? I want scrambled eggs. Ah. Easy. Every dish should be cooked with love. Therefore, my scrambled eggs will be in the shape of a heart. You need to fry the sausages and then break the egg. It turned out just wonderful. Awesome! The bigger the fire, the faster it gets fried, right? The stove to the maximum, and now the egg. Oh, um, the shell has fallen. Maybe it'll be unnoticeable. It's even better this way. No, you can still see the shell. We need to come up with something. I'll mix it up. Oh, honey, something's obviously gone wrong. Then I'll add milk. Now you definitely can't see anything. Watch and learn. This is how real chefs cook. Down with a frying pan, we're going to need a toaster. I'll chop the onion and garlic. Then an avocado. I'll mix it all together. Great. And now I'll use a blender. It turned out great. We need to spread it on the toast. Like that. Now it's the egg time. 
One will be quite enough. I'll break it into a bowl. And put the bowl in a saucepan with boiling water. That's what a wonderful egg I got. It remains only to stir the dish beautifully. Amazing! The final touch! Like that. Wow! It turned out to be really cool! I need to serve a dish too! Ketchup and mussels will do. Honey, are you sure? Ready? We'll see, we'll see. It doesn't look good. Wow, a heart! Grandma, this fried egg is definitely yours. Down with a fork. I want to take it with my hands. Mmm, delicious. Mm. And what do we have here? It looks interesting. And the taste? Mmm, yeah, something strange. <laughs> Granny definitely won. Oh, grandson, I'm so glad. What are we going to cook this time? Pizza. Pizza? Something complicated. And how do I cook it? Probably need to knead the dough. Mm, it worked. Or not really. Oh, why is it so sticky? Well, well. I have an idea. Take my dough, dear. Thank you, Grandma. But what about you? Oh. It doesn't matter. I'll need a new dough. All you need to do is mix a few ingredients. And I'll pour the finished dough into a hot frying pan. It'll turn out to be a wonderful pizza base. Then I'll pour ketchup and add healthy vegetables. And some cheese. While there, it remains only to wait. Yeah, who cooks pizza like that? Special corn flour is needed for the base. Only professionals like me know this. Then knead the dough. And now we need to form the bases. To do this, let's fly the dough. Wow. Oh, I want it that way too. Come on, fly. Oops, it fell. Well, now it's all dirty. How to fix it? I know, a little disguise won't hurt. A little ketchup. A little bit of olives next. Pepper. And sausages. And now we can fold everything. And of course, press it down. What a nightmare. I wish I hadn't seen it. Down with the vegetables. Tomato paste, pepperoni, and cheese. Nothing superfluous. And now I'll put the pizza in the microwave. Let it bake. It will turn out incredibly good. A microwave oven? The toaster will be enough. I would like to stuff it. Mm, yeah, it didn't turn out how I expected. And I did it perfectly. However, it couldn't be otherwise. Here's my pizza. Here is mine. And my masterpiece. Well, let's try. It seems that someone wanted to poison me. This is terrible. But this looks good. I'll try it. And it tastes pretty good. Wow! Mmm, this pizza is just perfect. And the most delicious one! Who else could have won if not me? Come on! I want pancakes. I'm a pancake master. Easy. I'll make the fire stronger. Great. And now carefully pour out the dough. It is very important to turn it over on time. I don't understand why you should make a lot of small pancakes if you could just make one big one. Besides, an ordinary pancake is boring. But with gummies... It's just great. Mm. Oh, the gummies have melted. Yeah, who would have thought? What? Okay, I'll make another pancake. This time with M&M's. And another one with multicolored sprinkles. 
and I'll pour maple syrup on the pancakes. And they're good. Well, we must not lag behind. I know. If you add Nutella to the dough, the dough will turn out to be chocolate. The main thing is to mix well. And I'll put a piece of chocolate in the center. Great. The chocolate is melting right in the center. Turn it over. Wait a little. Great. Berries to decorate pancakes. And now I'll pour strawberry syrup on top. Just wonderful. It looks perfect. Ready? Baked with love. The best pancakes in the world. You like mine the most. That's what we're going to find out. Hmm. Ugh. It's disgusting. And Granny's pancakes? Mmm. Delicious. So, so. What has the chef prepared? Mmm. Great. But Grandma won anyway. Hooray! So, now there'll be something interesting. Hey, Grandma, don't sleep. Oh, what am I? Here's the first task. Pancakes. What are you waiting for? Start cooking. Oh, this is my signature dish. Let's not waste time. My granddaughter has been hungry for a long time. Turning on the stove. We're taking a little. Getting the dough. And cooking it. It is very simple. So the first pancake is ready for my granddaughter. I've got it! Well, no fantasy. I'll make the brightest pancakes for my sister. She'll definitely like my idea. Let's pour it in. And now let's add some color. And another drop. Mix well. Wow! It looks really cool! Now we're going to the frying pan! It seems to be ready! Hurry up on the plate before it burns! I'll make pancakes of all colors of the rainbow! Awesome! Well, I'll decorate the pancakes with butter and maple syrup! Yeah! Delicious! How beautiful they are! So colorful! I'll add marshmallows to them, and I'll definitely win! That's yummy! Perfect! Just a masterpiece! Already drooling! Okay. I'll add more color sprinkles, and I can serve it! It turned out cool! It is hard for, for children to eat sweet, so I'll decorate my dish with a poached egg. We take a pot of water and put it on the stove. Be sure to make a whirlpool in it and pour a raw egg into boiling water. That's the whole secret! I'll add some ham to the pancakes and decorate it with salad. Our dish is almost ready. Carefully take out the egg and put it on the pancakes. The final touch, sprinkle with parsley and you can serve it! I'm proud of myself! Ugh, disgusting! Are you done? Then let's try! Wow, they're so delicious! I think I'll start with this one! Mmm! It's pretty tasty! Come on! Wow, these are so bright! Very tasty! This is clearly my favorite one! So, what do we have here? Ew! What a horror! This is not going to work! The color pancakes win! It's very tasty! Hooray! Now I want pizza! Oh yeah! Let's do it! Good choice! First, I'll cut out a piece of dough. 
I'll take tomato paste and thoroughly smear it on our pizza. I'll have to do it carefully. Like that. It's good that my brush is always at hand. With its help, cooking is much faster. Rub the cheese well. It will turn out very tasty. And finally, we're taking pepperoni. The pizza is almost ready. What are you doing? Oh. Oops. Oops. Oh, what a clumsy fellow you are. Ugh, oh, my pizza is gone. What? Is this for me? Thank you so much! I have an idea. I'll make a sweet pizza and it'll be the coolest. Okay. I'll add marshmallows instead of sauce. The pizza will be very tasty. What do we have here? Skittles! It's perfect. I'll use it for the filling. It's perfect. Oh, come on! Hmm, we need to come up with something unusual. Hey, I have an idea! I'll paint my pizza black. Oh, come on! Add a little dye and smear it all around. I'll use a brush for that. The base for my black pizza is ready. We'll take the tomato sauce and spread it evenly over the dough. Almost done. I've got it. It's turning out great. Of course, what a pizza without cheese. Okay. It definitely cannot be extra. There it is. It remains to add the toppings. I think seafood is perfect for such an unusual pizza. Just lovely. Awesome. Look at that. Our chefs are ready to send our pizzas to the oven. Ready! Hot pizza can be served on the table. Oh no! What happened to my pizza? It's ruined! And my pizza is fine. Mm, what a pleasant smell! It's time to try it. Wow! What kind of weird pizza is this? Is it black? And why are there shells on it? Ew! Wow! What a bright pizza! Let's try it. It's weird, but it'll do. What's next? This is my favorite pepperoni pizza! How delicious! This pizza wins! Thank you, granddaughter! Bon appetit! Now I want ice cream! I will make the most delicious ice cream for my granddaughter. Of course, I'll add a cake to it. I can already imagine how she will like my dessert. Okay, let's start. The most important thing is to finally chop each piece. Therefore, we take the blades and start grinding the cake as soon as possible. What is that? Why am I covered in sponge cake? Young man, why are you allowing yourself? Oh, sorry, I got a little carried away. <laughs> oh, what could be more simple? I'll make the best ice cream. Yes, perfect. However, as always, it's time to add decorations. I'll rub some orange peel. Everyone likes orange color. And, of course, a mint leaf. And now, my secret ingredient. I'll add steaming water. Oh, really? Oh, how beautiful! She came up with nonsense again and is happy. You have to cook with love. This is the only way the dish will become the most delicious. Um, it seems that something went wrong. Oh, this modern trendy dishes. Almost done. Okay. It remains to pour my favorite syrup and I can treat my granddaughter. Oh, that's it. Beautiful. Well, the ice cream is ready. It remains only to put it in a bowl and rock it. 
Okay. Yep, I think I'm on the right track. It looks cool. And whipped cream. My sister just loves it. Oh, wow. I'll take Skittles for decoration. They're so bright. The ice cream will be the most beautiful one. And also some of our favorite Oreos and add some sweet straws. Alright! Hmm, something is missing. Wow! Chocolate syrup! Can I borrow some? Okay. Great! The final touch is done. I've got it! Well, are you ready to show off your ice cream? Then go ahead. Where to start? Wow, how many things there are! Let's try it. This is the most delicious ice cream in my life! Very tasty! So what do we have here? Um, why is there a leaf on it? It's kind of strange. Let's leave it out. Ew, what a horror! I don't want to eat it. Hey, you! Let's try another one. Oh, it's weird. But quite tasty. Oh, man. The winner is this ice cream. Yeah, I won!